last four weeks have seen a whirlwind of activity within the Aula. Once a disparate body of more than 200 Jesuits from 60-plus countries around the world, the delegates have bonded, found common cultural touchstones, and built a community here in the Aula. In that time, they've convened only the 36th General Congregation in the history of the Society of Jesus. They've accepted the resignation of Father General Adolfo Nicolás. They've sought guidance within the celebration of the Eucharist at the Jesu, St. Peter's Basilica, and the Church of the Holy Spirit. They spent four days deep within the Murmuratio, elected Father Arturo Sosa as the 31st General Superior of the Society of Jesus, and received Pope Francis, who gave the congregation his guidance on the future of the Church and the Society. It's tempting to say that the congregation has done its job, but the truth is they've just started. Over the coming weeks, the delegates of GC36 will convene each day, from morning till evening, to pray over, discuss, and discern any documents and decrees to be released at the end of the congregation. Much of the work has been done in the months leading up to GC36, but the congregation must allow the process to complete unimpeded for the movement of the Holy Spirit to be made known. During these days, any delegate can ask for the floor at any time, sometimes for clarification, sometimes to interject with a piece that might be missing from the discussion. At some point in the coming weeks, there will be an announcement about Father General's new assistants, who will form the balance between Father General and the congregation that elected him. These assistants at Providencium and Regional will assist Father General on behalf of the Worldwide Society, informing him on the state of the society, formation, the international houses, and the like. More than just advisors, these assistants will also be tasked with stewarding Father General's personal and spiritual health as he leads the largest male religious order in the church. When the general congregation will end is not known outside of the aula. The delegates will continue until the work is complete, until the issues have been discussed, the ministry discerned, any decrees readied, and the delegates satisfied that their provinces, works, and brother Jesuits have been properly represented in this highest governing body of the Society of Jesus. <laughs>